Now, keeping you and your family safe, this is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. Oh, goodness. Yeah, if you step outside, you're going to get blown away, probably. Mm -hmm. yeah, it would be a good day to, um, I don't know, maybe mm -hmm. run if you're running in the right direction. Yeah, <laughs> yeah if you're going to Kansas. Blow you along, huh? Blow Make you right it there, there in record time. Put your car in neutral, just accelerate. That's right. We could tell you go. out all kind of weather jokes about <laughs> uh, wind, but uh, pretty windy out there. This is out ahead of a chance for showers and thunderstorms. We'll see this afternoon and this evening. Now, a few strong storms are possible. Some of these thunderstorms could have hail. This is what it looks like as far as the severe storms threat. This area in yellow represents a slight risk of severe weather, and a slight risk means there will be a few severe thunderstorms developing within this area. Not widespread, but a few severe thunderstorms. Looks like the best time for this will be between 4 p.m. and 10 p.m. tonight. The Tulsa area, then west, out toward Interstate 35, Ponca City, Wichita, and also the Oklahoma City area. Now, as far as our day ahead, the clouds have already moved in, so mostly cloudy for the rest of today. 50 55 degrees if you're headed out at noon. Dry weather at noon. At 5 p.m., increasing chances for rain and thunderstorms. So if you have outdoor plans this afternoon into the suppertime hours, it's possible you could be getting rained on. Then toward 10 p.m., seeing drier air moving in from the west. 53 degrees just before lunchtime. We began the day with sunshine. The clouds have now moved on in and plenty of wind to go around south wind at 25 miles per hour. As we showed you earlier, we're under a wind advisory. That advisory in effect until 6 p.m. Temperatures around the rest of green country trying to warm up despite the clouds. Low to mid 50s showing up warmer toward southeastern Oklahoma. 54 McAllister, 53 Eufaula, lower 50s into Independence, and upper 40s showing up to the west where the clouds have been a bit thicker out toward Stillwater, Ponca City, and Wichita. Now, dry weather. If you have outdoor plans the next few hours, the weather will be dry. Though the closer we get toward 5 p.m., the more likely you could get rained on. The rain is first going to develop to the north of Tulsa. This is where we're seeing an area of showers near Chanute toward Topeka. We'll likely see right through here. See this little area right through here near Wichita? This is what we are going to watch for showers and thunderstorms. This is where these strong storms would form if they do develop. And again, that would be between 4 and 10 p.m., the most likely time that you would get the storms. Huge area of low pressure moving across Kansas. We have a strong south and southeast wind out ahead of the low, which is pulling in the wind. Now, the future cast shows the dry weather for this morning and then this afternoon, increasing thunderstorm chances toward 5 p.m., higher rain chances north of Tulsa, and lower rain chances if you're headed south down toward the Dallas area. Looks like the Metroplex may missing out on this chance for thunderstorms. So, increasing clouds, mostly cloudy skies, high today in the lower 60s with a south wind at times gusty near 40 miles per hour. Then we'll see the wind turning to the west tonight. Once the wind turns to the west and northwest, your rain chances are done. By tomorrow morning, we'll see a low of 36. And the sunshine comes out on Tuesday. Should be a nice day for us. Wednesday is looking like spring with a high nearing 70 degrees. Stronger cool front will be arriving toward Friday. And on Friday, we'll see temperatures in the lower 50s for highs and a north wind. And we'll be watching rain chances toward the end of the weekend on Sunday. Goodness, you get through today, the rest mm -hmm. of the week looks like spring. <laughs> yeah, it looks really like good. smooth sailing the next few days. Sure does. Thank you, George. Just